had a horrible, horrible flight here. I came in from London. It was just one of those flights. You know when you get on the flight and you see a mother with a toddler that is totally fucking out of control? <laughs> you know, and everyone's thinking the same thing. Everyone's just thinking, please, please don't sit next to me. Please. <laughs> you know, even the really fat guy's thinking, oh, fuck, please don't sit next to me. <laughs> you know, even the shoe bomber's thinking, please don't fucking sit next to me. <laughs> well, I am that mother. <laughs> Sorry, hello, it's me. <laughs> it was horrible, My she went totally nuts. And the thing is, like I'm not, I'm not a patient parent, you know, and I feel bad about that because whenever I see mums who are really patient, I envy them. You know, like, you know the mums who never lose their shit? You know, you see them in cafes and stuff. You know the ones who talk to their kids like, no, 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 darling, no. No. <laughs> Mummy's asked you very nicely not to drive nails into mummy's face. <laughs> no. Hey, now, put down, the, put down the power drill. It's you. <laughs> hey, now, mummy's getting really angry. Mummy's really angry now. <laughs> mummy's furious. Okay, now, mummy's feeling isolated. This, this is meant to be a symbiotic relationship. I mean, do you ever watch parents like that and just think, why don't you just fucking hit them? <laughs> First round of applause. Bash your kids! Yeah! That's, uh, I mean, don't punch them unconscious. Because they won't remember. <laughs> I, did, I mean, I don't have a huge problem with smacking. Like my, bro my brother and I, we were smacked. We were, you know, that was, that was fine. My mother hates it when I tell this story on stage. Um, <laughs> hence, I'm telling it at a televised gig. Uh, but there was, there was this one time, right, where my mother took my brother and I to this sports store when we were kids, you know, and we were just going nuts. We were like throwing golf balls at each other. And, you know, my brother threw a cricket stump at my head. And, uh, you know, my mom was like, did you stop that? Just cut that out. Like she was really, you know, and we were, we, we were pushing it. We knew she was on the brink, right? And she totally lost her shit, right? And she picked up a shoe. <laughs> it was the 1970s. It was the last true golden era for bashing your children in a public space. <laughs> now, that and smoking in hospitals, thing of the past. <laughs> she picked up this shoe, right, and she hit my brother on the back of the legs. Right? And the whole sports store was just like, <gasps> And my mum didn't realise it, but she'd accidentally picked up a spiked athletics trainer. <laughs> Tell you what, though, we never fucked around in a sports store again. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, have a great night. <laughs>